Hi, today we'll talk about five features of CG interpretation. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. Number one, QRS complex. The QRS complex consists of three waves. Q, the first negative wave before the R wave, R, any positive wave of the QRS complex, S, negative wave after the R wave. What does a negative QRS complex mean? It means a dominant S wave. S is greater than R wave. What does a positive QRS complex mean? It means a dominant R wave. R is greater than S wave. On this slide you can see different types of QRS complex. Pay attention to this type. QRS complex we always see with myocardial infarction and this type with right bandle branch block. Number 2. Rhythm interpretation. Is irregular rhythm always atrial fibrillation? No. We can see irregular rhythm with multifocal atrial tachycardia or premature complexes, like this. When we talk about atrial fibrillation, it's irregular, irregular rhythm. D wave inversion. It can be symmetric or asymmetric. Symmetric D wave inversion we can see with myocardial ischemia. Asymmetric T wave inversion we can see with left ventricular hypertrophy. Sometimes you can see biphasic T wave with positive and negative parts. If you see the second negative part, it's most likely myocardial ischemia. V1 and V2 misplacement. Lids V1 and V2 are located in the sternum's fourth intercostal space just to the right and left. Upwards misplacement of V1 and V2 often produced an incomplete right bandle bridge block pattern. Or it looks like myocardial infarction, namely QS complexes at least V1 and V2. Male pattern. Sometimes we can see ST segment elevation from 1 to 3 mm at least from V1 to V3 in healthy young men. It's normal and called the male pattern. Thank you for watching my video. If you like this type of video, please comment below and subscribe to my channel.